this is why you watch out for pieces that are caught between the fence and the blade. Alrighty, so those are going to be the edges. And these are going to be the carriers for the LED strips. And then there is one other piece that I cut. And this is a little thicker. And this will be the cross members. So I think these LED strip carriers will have a couple of cross members just to support them. And then, then that gets all ensconced in the, um, the wrap with the, um, with the <clears throat> stuffing as the cloud cover. But I need to clean this uh, bench off before I can do any of that. Okay, that's starting to come together. So I need to do some fitting in there, and then in between those two will come a junction box. And then that <clears throat> gets mounted onto the ceiling, obviously. No, well, well, that should be okay. That should be all right, totally all right. So now, um, finger joints for the other end, maybe? That's the next step. Get those to the right length. Okay, we need to uh, clean those up to get the angle right, I think. Yeah, I'll, I'll do that, get the angle right. But uh, yeah, so that's one side of the lamp right there. these and then on the cross member the cross member gets recessed there as well and then let the uh, laps into the top so yeah at some point <clears throat> I got sloppy and stopped thinking <laughs> and that was the result now you might not be able to see it underneath the the uh, draperies that are going on there, but I don't care. I'm gonna redo it anyways. And uh, these are just these are just cut too loose as well. So yeah, that's I'm not gonna have that. Just remake them tomorrow. Okay, but it is quite possible to cut nice notches and have it be a snug fit. So that's definitely what I'm gonna do and. Uh, as far as the scale model is concerned, that looks pretty good to me. One to one scale. Okay, and so that is what the LEDs are going to lie on. And they stick down quite nicely.
Okay. So that's the basic idea. And I think it's going to work. Okay, so pin headers like this are not going to cut it um, because I'm, I have to make a custom cable anyways and I don't have any um, three pin bodies. So I'm going to replace them with something that's more suitable, which is indexed and uh, same pin spacing, but a more robust connector. Isn't gonna pull apart. Pull out. <laughs> 